Hey everyone, it's Sandra and Nev here. Hi! Back with another game. This time it's Clam Bake. This is a request from Chris Faber. Hi Chris, from the Apple II Enthusiasts Facebook group. We've never seen this game. Don't know what kind of game it is. I hope it's not like B-Run or anything. <laughs> is it made by the same guy? I don't even know who this is by. Oh, okay. Alright, Clam Bake. Let's see what this game is. It's made in 1984. This is from a Nibble disc from the Nibble magazine. Nib what? There was a computer magazine for Apple IIs called Nibble. Okay. And uh, they put out these discs with stuff on them. Clam bake. By William Poo. <laughs> Eat all the diatoms to advance while avoiding the menacing jellyfish? What are diatoms? You can pause this if you want to read it. L, a thingy, A, and Z. Alright, space to play. Do you want to go first? Uh, sure. I know. I know. Okay. Whoa! Whoa! Okay. Oh, it's a Pac-Man clone. Okay. Wait a second. Whoa! What? How do I... Z, Z. I did! Oh, Wait man, a shit. second. Let's see. I got stuck! Huh? This isn't working. Game over. What? Change keys. There we go, look at this. Okay. It's This uh, is Pac-Man. Yeah. Oh you got it. Yeah. Oh, that's what? a bit annoying. Oh, it's a snail. What? It slows everything down. Yeah, but it slows you down. Why do you keep going over it? Stop. Because it's giving me points. Oh. This is unfair. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> this is terrible. You're gonna die now. Yep. <laughs> Wait a second. This is exactly Pac-Man. <laughs> That's a good idea. Oh, please, stop. I, I'm sorry. Get them. One. This is exactly Pac-Man. Yeah. There are lots of Pac-Man clones around this time. What uh -oh. the hell? I don't know. That was the sound to say it's going to turn off soon or something. It did turn off though. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, nice. Whoa. Oh, yeah. Whoa. What was that? I don't know. Wow, they're just kind of sticking around down the bottom. They're not quite as smart as the uh, ghosts in Pac-Man. They are the ghosts in Pac-Man. Watch out. Oh. Uh-oh. What? Ah. Uh. Whoa. Go, go, go. Go, what? go, go, go. I'm trying. Woohoo. Oh. Maze 2. Oh, please don't go over the snail. <laughs> hey, it's a different maze. Yeah. It said maze too. You literally said maze too. Oh, that was a waste of a power pill. <laughs> you know, it's so long since I've actually played Pac-Man, the original, that I can't remember if the maze has changed. <laughs> I, I get the feeling that they just stayed the same. <laughs> ah! It's huh? it's not bad. Can you press the key before you get there? I think so. Yeah. Whoa! Oh! Whoa! I'm gonna have to do it, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> it gives me points anyway. I'm bringing them all over. Watch this. Ha! Nice. Go go go! I'm trying. Yes. Oh, oh my no. goodness. Two clams. I still have a clam. Whoa! Are they like jellyfish or something? They are jellyfish. Whoa! Nice. Nice <sighs> three. One clam. What does that noise mean? It means watch out. They're back to normal. Oh. They're back to normal. Watch out. 
Don't go after them now. They're, yeah, hanging around down there in the right. They're doing exactly the same thing over and over again. Wait, what is that thing over there? This is going. I see something. What is this? Nothing. Which the graphics are not bad. Come back here, come back here, come back here. Uh, ah, what? So quick. change the cover. Alright, I'm going to change the keys. Oh, down, right, left. Okay, cover. Ooh, Whoa. that's terrible. Okay, so it was designed for green screen, obviously. Oh, I'm checking my skill. Ooh, one, two. Oh, no, disaster. Okay. By the way, go across the snail because it um, it's a pretty easy game. Yeah, it is. Like, compared to the actual Pac-Man, I'm finding this very easy. I pretty much always found it this easy. Going Look, I mean, hole. they didn't even just come down there when I was right next to them. Yeah. Nice Pretty silly. Tell you what, I'm going to pause this and go back to green. Oh, no. I wonder what a periwinkle is. Okay. Last game. <gasps> you got this. Wait, last game? Yeah. Well, unless you want to play again. I'd like to play again, but if I'm completely honest, this game is... Very... Oh, look, all four. Hey! hey. Oh. My professional opinion is that this game is very silly. Silly. Not like, well I'm right made. there and they just go... What are they doing? They're just kind of wandering across and... It's kind of weird. The, the AI of the uh, creatures is not that great. So Chris said on the Facebook group, it's not as good as he remembers it, uh, which happens sometimes when you go back and revisit something, and it's like, oh, I thought it was so good, but then it's like, hmm, it's not that great. And apparently there are pearls. Huh? Pearls? How do you know? Oh, because it said in the instructions. Yeah, periwinkles, pearls, and snails. Maybe we just haven't gotten far enough. Yeah, we probably haven't. That or the power thingies, the power pellets are the pearls. So what was that sound? I don't know. Yeah, I got off off. Yay. Alright, let's just finish this. Finish Just go for the pellets, Dad. Hey, there's five of them. Oh my goodness, there are. Wow. Um. Oh, there's all that down there. Mm-hmm. You got this, though. Oh. Oh. Wow, that was close. <laughs> What's that 
thinking. It's a snail. I don't die though. See, the snail. Beep. Beep. Oh, okay. eat all the diatom, di diatoms. I don't know. They're all the little pills. I'd say the pearls are the power pellets, and what are the periwinkles? Or maybe those are the periwinkles, and the pearls something else. Oh, the pearls are probably the um, the power pills. Yeah, that's what I said, but I realized that the periwinkles says question mark. So. Oh, like, maybe the periwinkles are what the jellyfish turn into. Oh, yeah. That'd yeah. be it. Well, um, yeah. Not much of a good game. It's bad. It's a copy of Pac-Man. It's not deep sea <laughs> at all. It's definitely not great. I mean, it's okay. Yeah, it's like fine. So before running this game, uh, I did some searches for this on the internet and I could not find any references to it at all except on the nibble disc. Really? Yeah. No YouTube videos, no Moby Games entry. I mean it is kind of a just one of one of these uh magazine disc games, so maybe that's fair enough. But uh I think we can yeah. see why it's never been <laughs> put on YouTube. Yeah. Hey, this is the first time. <laughs> you want to sum it up? How? Uh, it's a copy of Pac-Man and it wasn't done too great. It was okay. It was fine, but still not great. Yeah. Uh, I'm looking forward to playing Nibbler. Yeah, I am. Yeah. I am too. Yeah, I, I just had a brief look at the graphics for that and it looked like it was quality. And it's, and it's written by someone who went on to do other things. Actual wrote, wrote games. Whereas oh. I, I don't, I couldn't find any reference to this guy. Okay. All right. Well, thanks, Chris. Uh, yeah. It was fun, anyway. It sort of was. It was like, eh, uh, it wasn't too great. <laughs> you keep saying it wasn't too great. I don't think we'll play that one again. I don't think I. There either. are better, better uh, Pac-Man clones out there. Yeah. Yeah. So, mm. check this out. This is Nibble Magazine. So this okay. is the magazine that used to have these programs in it, right? Yeah. And so it had Clambeck in it. Uh, where are we? Down here, page 45. All right, so I'll go to page 45. Here we go. Clambeck. <gasps> what? Yeah. Hey, by the way, I've, I figured out when you get the, the pearls or whatever, then you can get the snail. It doesn't slow you down. You get, like, extra points if you get the snail, if you get one of the power pill things. Oh. Yeah. Anyway, here's some information. You can pause this video if you want and uh, read this information. But, right, you didn't get a disc when you got this magazine. Okay. The program is in the magazine. So you would have to type in all this. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. Yeah. So you'd actually have to go and, like, type 
well, the, the first four characters are a memory address. You'd have to try the the eight eight bytes after it, and you'd have to do all that and all that and all this and there, right? So that gets down to here, and then these are these special codes that you'd type in to check that you hadn't made any mistakes. Oh. <laughs> yeah. You'd have to type in all of those, and if you made a mistake, then... Yeah. Oh. And that's claimbake1, and this is claimbake.2. This is another file. So that's all the checks for that one. And then claimbake.3. Can you imagine typing all that in? No, I can't. <laughs> I think I only did that thing a couple of times because it was just so tedious. Wait, but you actually did all this? Well, not this program, but other programs. I, I definitely typed in programs. Yeah. Wow. And it was so exciting when you'd run it for the first time and you'd have this game. Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty amazing, right? Yeah. <laughs> anyway, thought that would be interesting. Wow. Okay. Well, if you like this video, subscribe, comment. Give us a like, it's always appreciated, and we'll see you in the next one. Okay, bye! Bye!